Hi everybody, you're watching Newegg TV. I'm Jennifer, and today I've got a little bit something different for you. First up, I have an overview of the Western Digital Green Drive, and then I'm going to go through a couple use case scenarios. One of those is I'm going to show you how to expand the storage in an existing PC that is booting from an SSD, which might be a little bit novice for some of you, but we accept that there are PC builders of all level ranges watching our channel, so we wanted to cover this and use the Western Digital Green Drive to illustrate it. After that, I'm going to show you guys some of the Intel smart response technology and its capabilities utilizing a little system built by Thermal Take and some others and by Western Digital that will show you how you can get SSD RAID speeds using an SSD and traditional mechanical hard drive setup in your system. So let's get started. This is the WD60EZ RX 6TB green drive. It features 64 megabytes of cache and is intended to be an affordable way to add mass storage to a full-size system. The benefits of the technology of Western Digital Green Drives are balanced performance and power management, reduced heat output, and their IntelliSync technology, which governs the hardware, making the actuator move smoothly from sector to sector, reducing power use and vibration. Next, I'm going to show you how to add storage to an established system. For fastest boot speeds, use the green drive in addition to an SSD boot drive like the 256 gigabyte drive in this system. We have already installed the operating system and if you want to know how, check out Paul's How to Build a PC video by clicking the link in the description below. When installing the green drive, be sure that you have the appropriate connectors available from your power supply and a new SATA cable. Don't forget to clean up your cable management after you're done for best airflow and to alleviate tension on connectors that may get squished by a side panel. Once you have reconnected power to your system and started it, you can set up the drive by going into Disk Management. To access Disk Management in Windows 8.1, right-click the Windows icon at the bottom right of the screen, select Computer Management. When the window opens, select Disk Management from the list on the left. From there, you'll be able to see the Western Digital Green Drive if the system is detecting it properly. You may need to initialize the drive, which it will prompt you to do. Initialization is important if you need to partition off parts of the drive for other purposes such as emergency backup, but for now we're going to leave it as is. If you are using this drive as your games library, be sure to change your default save drive in your game server. This is easy to do and in Steam you are usually prompted when you download a game for the first time on a given system. Now let's change topics slightly to a use case scenario for the green drives. Intel Smart Response technology is available on Intel chipset motherboards and is easy to set up when you first build a system. It isn't impossible when you have a system completed, but it is challenging and outside of the scope of what I want to cover in this video. Here we have a mini ITX build that is a collaboration with Thermaltake, Samsung, Asus, and of course the Western Digital Green Drives. The Intel Smart Response technology is an Intel Rapid Storage Technology caching feature that improves system performance by allowing systems with an SSD to use a portion of the drive to be used as a cache memory between the hard disks and the system memory. If you're a novice PC builder, that probably sounded like a lot of words linked loosely together in something like English, but not. Sorry. Stay with me here. The ISR technology gives SSD-like read and write speeds to a system using traditional mechanical drives like the WD Green. So that means loading your games and other programs faster. To illustrate this, WD sent us this little system with a speed test program on it. Let's take a look. So on this little system that's using the Intel Smart Response technology, we have IO meter, which is a way to gauge what different speeds are on drives. It's very challenging to set this up and basically was just installed on this system as a purpose of displaying to you what the read speeds could be with the Intel Smart Response configured using a 120 gig SSD and this one is off of the 6 terabyte drive so you're, we're showing a read speed of over 500 um, MBS per second and that is about the read speeds that you would expect using uh, multiple SSDs in a RAID configuration. So this is the specific benefit of using the Intel Smart Response. All right, everybody, thank you so much for joining me for this overview slash tutorial slash intro to Intel Smart Response technology featuring the Western Digital Green Drive. I really appreciate it. And if you like this video, please like it and subscribe to our various YouTube channels. Until next time, I'm Jennifer, and thank you for watching Newegg TV.